Thank you. Again, my name is Luis Terosa. I'm the president of the Puerto Rican Chamber of Commerce based out of Miami-Dade County. And, of course, we're here to serve you. And we do that through many ways. One, of course, is business-related information, uh, Expo Rico, uh, other workshops and, and, and seminars that disseminate information on how to do business between Puerto Rico and Miami-Dade County. But for the most part, we're concerned about people here because we live here and we're residents of Miami-Dade County and we're here to help you. But one of the things that we think about often in our, uh, in our circles of friends and, uh, and supporters is the arts. The arts is very, very important. And joining Jay today, a personal friend of ours, and before I go any further introduce this gentleman, I'd like to give out uh, Jay's number, which is 786-333-2855 for those who need some additional information on his collection of work. Let us know, because this way we can, of course, invite our friends, and we like to invite uh, Jay and, and his people as well. And uh, when, they, when Jay does his, his uh, presentation, we like for you to be there as well. But he's, he has a dear spot, spot in his heart for, for Puerto Rico and Puerto Ricans. Is that so, Jay? Yeah. Um, that Caribbean island, which is not that big, resides in a small realm in my heart. The gentleman that raised Welcome. My name is Luis Rosa. I'm president of the Puerto Rican Chamber of Commerce. Of Be an extra a Puerto Rican to me because I share a unique bond, a spiritual bond with that island. And I hope throughout all my life the message is positive, the message of humanity, the message of hope, and the message that... The interesting part that the audience uh, should be reminded of that you're actually colorblind. Yeah. And, 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 and when you comprise your art, when you actually go into that, that, that level, there's a different level when you're doing your, your work. Is that correct? You guys are artists. You know this better than I do. I'm not an artist. You know, I'm just a promoter, if you will. But what, what, what does it take and where does it take you? And can you describe it so we can understand it as lay people? Well, I cannot explain. Well, what we do, and if I could speak for my colleague a second, what we do is we take you on this journey. We take you on this river of flowing dreams where you see 10,000 stars, and at its banks are some of our pain, passion, some of our anger, some of our fury. We bring these together in this particular dream. We follow it to the core of this river of flowing dream, and then we bestow it on canvas. We splash it like water on canvas. And then it's our hope that society un understands not the work, but what's in the mind of painter, what resides in the mind of simply the word painter. Is it important for you to project that? To me, it's, it's very important because I'm disabled. I have metal in my back. When, when I stand, I'm in a lot of pain. When I lay down, I'm in a lot of pain. 
99.9% of my existence is in pain. However, I don't want to show pain. I want to show people the perseverance over pain, the joy, the ecstasy, when one can control this creature we call pain, project it onto canvas, give, give you this grand vicissitude from another world, and understand that life for me may be in pain, but I bestow upon you this mystic kiss from my soul. Interesting. You just leave me. I don't know what to say. <laughs> but I can tell you one thing. I really appreciate your work and appreciate that you're oh, coming here today with us. Um, and I, and let, yeah, when's the last time you've had a nice plate of Puerto Rican food? You know, home gandule, arroz con habichuela. I was here to say frijol de negro. We say well, habichuela. You know? If you don't say chuletas fritas con bacalao y batatas, you're not talking to me. <laughs> the taste. I cannot taste paint, but if I could, I think it would taste like chuleta. <laughs> <laughs> Even though you have to be very up to watch all of that. We're going to be taking another break, and when we come back, you know, we'll say some party words, but I just wanted to say thank you on behalf of the community. But thank you. We'll be right back. Please don't go away. Again, I'm Luis Tarosa, and I want to thank you for taking time away from your busy schedule and being with us today at the show uh, brought to you by the Puerto Rican Chamber of Commerce entitled Puerto Rican Forum. You walk outside, a mutt or an old dog cast, give it an embrace. Remember one thing if you forget everything else in life, humanity is first. Thank you very much. Thank you, Hector. Appreciate it. Thank you, Jay. God bless you. We'll see you next time.